Meanwhile, Intel has announced a $100 billion investment to build and expand chip factories across four U.S. states. This comes after securing almost $20 billion in federal grants and loans through the CHIPS Act with the potential for an additional $25 billion in tax breaks. The centerpiece of this plan is a new facility near Columbus, Ohio, which Intel aims to make the largest AI chip manufacturing site in the world by 2027. This project, along with expansions in Arizona and New Mexico, signifies a major shift for Intel and the U.S. government. Intel's investment comes as the company seeks to regain its footing in chip manufacturing. And that's being paired with over $100 billion from Intel, including $30 billion in Arizona and $30 billion in Ohio. It's among the largest private sector investments ever in the history of Ohio and in Arizona. And this historic funding will use to build new semiconductor fab facilities and modernize, modernize and expand existing ones in Arizona, Ohio, New Mexico, and Oregon. Combined, it will create nearly 20,000, 20,000 construction jobs, many of which will be union jobs. This announcement will also support 10,000 manufacturing jobs, 3,000 right here in Phoenix with salaries averaging over $100,000 a year and don't all require college degrees. That's a change. Well, in recent years, Asian rivals like TSMC and Samsung have surpassed them technologically. Uh, this plan backed by the U.S. government aims to not only strengthen Intel, but also bolster its domestic chip production. Well, the CHIPS Act, with its grants and incentives, is a key part of this strategy. The U.S. currently produces only about 12% of the world's semiconductor, a drastic decline from past decades. This initiative aims to increase that number majorly, potentially reaching 20% by the end of the decade. Experts also caution that this will be a long journey. Building new factories take time and Intel still faces stiff competition. Meanwhile, experts also suggest further government support might be needed to fully reclaim chip manufacturing leadership.